right everyone so today is all about the static contraction for most of the workout today we are going to be holding positions that really require you to engage and contract and really hold in those stomach muscles so we're going to do each position for about 30 seconds at the end of each segment we will be doing some crunches or some type of push-up or a moving ab motion all right so it's going to be an eight minute workout. I hope you're ready because I sure am. And before I get started, I have to say the day that this is getting posted is my husband and my eight year anniversary. We've been married for eight years and it's been wonderful. I just have to say to Jared that I love you. It's our first anniversary away from each other because he's off getting trained with the army. So I just want to say happy anniversary to the most wonderful husband in the world. And it's about to thunder, so I better hurry up and get this workout done. All right. We are going to start in just a regular plank position, holding it for 30 seconds. So your abs are engaged. You are trying to stay in a nice straight line. I like to be on my forearms. It's a little bit more challenging. A little bit less challenging is up on your arms, okay? Or you can always take it down to your knees. Just do what you can. Just hold it, breathe. It's all about just maintaining that perfect alignment. 30 seconds, then lift one leg and just hold it. It's only 30 seconds. You can do it. Woo. Really think about contracting holding in, sucking in those ab muscles and that leg that's lifted, you feel it in your glutes too, tightening that rear end. Five more seconds and we're switching legs. Come on, you can do it. And switch legs. You can do this. Don't let your hips drop. If you feel yourself slumping, tighten back up. Maintain a nice straight body as if your body is a board. Hold it, hold it, hold it. 10 more seconds and we're gonna do some push-ups, okay? Three, two, one, foot down. Come up to your forearms. Let's do some push-ups. Hang in there with me. All right, let's get ready for the next position. You are going to just be first to start out keeping your shoulder blades or your shoulders off the floor. We're gonna go a little bit higher here in a little bit, so get ready. Just hold it, abs really tight. You can have your arms up here, it's a little bit more challenging. Arms down here. Just try to keep your shoulders off the mat. Ready? A little bit higher. Hi. Hi, Fine, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> I'm in my front yard and neighbors walking by. All right, so the first position was just your shoulders off the mat. You're trying to get a little bit more off the mat. The third position, you're trying to get your whole shoulder blade off the mat. So get ready. Whew. Five more seconds. We're going to do that. Here we go. Try to get your whole shoulder blade off the mat. Whole shoulder blades. Just hold it. Keep breathing. Of course, as soon as I come out in the front yard, every single neighbor's walking by. It's kind of embarrassing, so you think I'd be used to it? <laughs> I'm not. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Ooh, hold it. You feel those abs really tight, 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 tight. Ooh, keep the whole entire shoulder blade off the mat. If your neck is getting tired, press your finger pads into the back of your head. It'll help. We're just going to take it to pulsing crunches here. Here we go. Pulse. Come on, pulse it. 
Close it. All right, we're gonna get ready for the next position. You're in a side plank, all right? Take this knee out in front of you and pull it up towards your shoulder here. Just hold that, that's all you're doing. Okay, abs are tight. You're fighting the urge to let your hips drop. And I only set my timer for five minutes, but I needed eight minutes, so it's gonna ding, but don't you stop. I'm gonna reset it. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Whew. Really actively pull that knee up towards your shoulder. Starting to drizzle here. Whew. Hang in there with me. Don't let those hips drop. We're gonna go back to just that regular forearm plank. Don't get stormed on. I want to finish this workout. And just a regular forearm plank. Just holding it. You stay there. I'm going to go to this side because. I don't want to have my back to you when I go the other way. There we go. Remember, just keep breathing. Whew. Abs stay tight and engaged the whole time. Don't let your hips drop. Don't stick them up in the air. Nice and flat. All right, here we go. Side plank. Pull that knee in towards your shoulder. It's not on top. It's in the front of your body a little bit. Tight abs. Just hold it. Then we're gonna go back to push-ups. Oh, really pull that knee in towards your shoulder. All right, get into that push-up position. Let's do a few push-ups. Come on, hang in there with me. Looking ahead of you as you go down, trying at least to get your arms to that 90 degree angle. All right. What you're gonna do, the next position that we're holding, lean back, pick your knees, your feet up, knees are bent. Pulling your arms towards your Ankles there, just hold it. Just keep breathing. You got this. Right, you can do this. Keep those abs engaged. Feels so good to work the core. But please never forget, you really wanna uncover those abs. You have to be doing at least 30 minutes of cardio three times a week and you need to eat clean, okay? Good sources of lean protein, lots of that. Fruits, vegetables, whole grains, avoiding the refined sugars and flours. All right, lean back a little bit more and extend one leg out. Woo, you feel that one, right? Hold it. This thigh that's extended, it's really working. So you're getting a little bonus right there. Working that thigh. I must have added my time up wrong because it's gonna go off again, but we are not done. Switch legs. Switch legs, switch legs. So the other leg is extended. You are reclined back, hands in towards your ankle. Abs are really tight and engaged. Just a static contraction. Come on, hang in there with me. Whew. And the rain is coming down, but that's okay. Whew. Really keep those abs engaged. Don't give up, we're almost there. Okay, recline back. Come up towards your ankles, back and extend. 
We're almost there, almost there. Don't give up, come on. It's about to ding and we're really gonna be done this time, come on. There we go. And we're done, you guys. Awesome work. Now you have the rest of your day to go and enjoy. And I will see you on Thursday for our Killer Thursday workout. Bye, everyone.